So real quick before I try to get myself to get bitten, um, earlier, as I was saying, her her uh, chemical glands, her odor glands, um, has like a reddish orangish color. And ever since she laid eggs for me, um, I had yet to see them, but I can actually see it now. This is what I was describing earlier. So right now she's releasing them. And that is what it looks like on the inside. Very interesting. All right, so now I'm gonna need you to bite me, please. Let's just go straight for it. Ooh. Oh yeah. Ooh, oh yeah. Very, very interesting, wow. Oh, her rostrum stuck in me. All right. Hmm. Very, very interesting. Um, as you can see, it's starting to swell up. Uh, I wouldn't say. I mean, it. <laughs> let me just let me just wait on it. Hold on. I'm gonna put her in her enclosure while this just remains on my arm. Let me get the camera to focus. There we go. Let me put her in. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't like how I thought it was going to be. I I truly thought that it was going to be a lot more painful. The swelling though, I mean, it, you can see it's starting to like starting to become red. Um I don't know. It just It just wasn't bad like and I'm not saying that in a boastful way like oh you know I'm so strong but it really truly it wasn't bad at all some burning as the venom started to pump in my arm uh, from the initial bite that was probably the most painful but even after I mean it didn't really leave much besides a little purplish dot on my arm but yeah um I mean I can try again let me let me get her out. Let me let me go for a second round. All right, here we go. I'm gonna go for it again. Mm, let's go under it. Come on, focus camera. Hold on. Need it to focus. There we go. All right. Camera isn't really focusing. I'm. Oh, there we go. Apologize about that. And once again, her rostrum is lodged in my my flesh. There we go. All right. So, and there's the second bite, right there. Well, you, the first bite, you can see like a ring, a puffy ring starting to form around it. Very cool. But I'm just going to put her back in. You 
very, very, very good girl. I appreciate your venom. I just wish it was stronger. <laughs> All right, well, I had a pretty fun time making this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it as well. If you have any questions about wheel bugs, please, in the comments, leave them down below, and I will try to do my best to answer them. Now, the bite, I don't know if you guys can see from here, like where I'm sitting, or if the camera even picks it up, but um, it, it really, it truly was not bad at all. Um, from everything I've heard from them having this excruciating, you know, extremely painful bite, um, it really didn't live up to the hype at all. And I'm not just saying that to say it, it, it truly just wasn't bad at all. Um, but you know, it's whatever. <laughs> I'm, I can, I'm happy I can gladly say I've, I've been envenomated by a species of assassin bug. Um, there's some other species of assassin bugs within the hobby, uh, like white spot assassin bugs, red spot, um, mambo, or even like horrid king assassin bugs. Um, I'll try to envenomate myself with them and see if they kind of, um, you know, pack a, more of a punch than the wheel bug. But I digress. But if you guys enjoyed the video, um, if you could please leave a like and a comment. Um, and if you haven't yet already, please subscribe and hit the bell icon to turn on post notifications. Um, I'd really appreciate that. Also, follow me on Instagram at Kelvin Wiley. I, not too long ago, just hit 100,000 followers on Instagram. So for those of you who are subscribed to this channel who also follow my Instagram page, uh, thank you, thank you so much. Um, I would not be able to achieve that if it weren't for you um, subscribing and following me, which I greatly, greatly appreciate. Um, I can't thank you guys enough. So like I said, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and comment and subscribe if you are new. And I will see you guys in the next video.